Hello everyone, I am Esh. Welcome back to Esh's Lab with the Feed the Beast Monster mod pack. I'm in a jungle. In fact, I'm not just in a jungle, I'm on top of a jungle. And that's for no reason other than it looked cool whenever I thought about starting the recording. So welcome to the jungle. You're gonna die. Um, that actually wasn't planned, but it felt natural to make that joke um, because I'm unoriginal. That said, I'm out here, I was hunting down a certain tree, a uh, rubber tree. I needed some rubber tree saplings because I need rubber. Because today we are going to be working on our farm a little bit, and we want to be using mine factory reloaded blocks to uh, make our farms automatic. Automate everything we can do. Now, obviously, oh, look at this. Um, so first of all, if you don't know how to locate far, uh, rubber rubber trees, um, they're the ones that have these uh, erections. They're the, the, the trees with the weird erections on the top, so you're going to look for those. They're the same color as like a birch tree. They're just like this uh, disgusting olive color, but they have these uh, leaf penises on the top that are just fully hard and erect. And uh, that's how you get it. Now, there are various ways to extract rubber from these trees. Uh, for instance, you could just plant some, and they have these... Oh, my, my thing broke here. That sucks. Uh, I don't have any more axes on me, so I'm just going to fist this. I'm going to fist this tree. And um, so these things are dropping resin, rubber resin, I think. Uh, it's called sticky resin. And you would normally you can just cook that resin, and it'll turn into a rubber ball. And you can use that for whatever you need rubber for, obviously. Uh, also, you can extract rubber from the rubber wood uh, with an extractor, uh, obviously enough. Uh, we don't have one of those, so we're probably going to build one. Um, in addition, this mod pack is supposed to let you cook various other things into rubber. For instance, uh, more the most obvious one is you're supposed to be able to cook uh, what are they call slime balls into rubber in a, in a furnace. But it isn't working. At least I can't make it work. I did try it in the rubber. It, 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 it tells you to, to cook it in the redstone furnace specifically, so I figured I would do that. And it's, it just doesn't function correctly. It's not cooking them at all. Now, there is the idea that maybe I could just use it on a regular furnace. It might work, but at this point, I've already took the time to go out there and find several trees worth of rubber. I got seven saplings to plant for our own little rubber, rubber farm, and as soon as we build an extractor, I'll be able to use the extractor on the wood in order to get um, in order to get rubber from the wood directly. So I'm gonna go ahead and plant these trees uh, like so um, for now. Now they may not grow. This place is a little bit too short for tree growth, but I'm gonna plant them anyway. We had one in the back. I cut it down. It just wasn't enough and I didn't have an extractor. So I've cleared the wheat farm out um, of all of its wheat. So this is going to be where we're going to start our first automatic farm. And what I want to put on the automatic farm are the various magical crops that we have so far, which really is just the uh, coal crop and the essence crop. Um, so let's go ahead and actually f put some stuff up. Um, put like the sapling up, for instance. And... Maybe this apple, stuff like that. Um, so I have, I've, we've worked a little bit on this before. We put, so we have four regular essences, for instance, and uh, we have a regular infusion stone and so forth, but we ran to the wall where we actually would need a bunch of coal essence to actually upgrade to the next tier of things. So we'll go from like coal to like iron or something like that. Um, the the first tier of stuff you can grow with magical crops is pretty mundane. And then, uh, what the hell? How did you even get in here? Oh, there's a hole in the wall. It's like the chicken entrance, apparently. You, sir, are dead. I don't have that hat, so you, your death is in vain. I'm, I'm, man, we have several holes in this place. I need to fill those in with marble. Either way, this is going to be the site for our first farm because I didn't feel like really hooking up another uh, thing. It's already here, you know, so why not? Now, uh, we're going to be using Mine Factory Reloaded, which means we need a planter and a harvester, I believe. Uh, the planter will automatically plant the seeds and stuff over and over again for us, and we'll be able to tell it what we want to plant in each sector of the farm. 
and then the harvester will be the one that's cutting everything down and uh, taking everything that it drops and putting it somewhere where we want it to go. Um, so we just need to figure out how big those things cover because I can't really remember to be honest. Um, I will. I think we've already tried it. Yeah, never mind. So um, we're obviously going to be missing two spots in the middle because of the water thing, but I think it's worth it. Uh, just to be able to grow faster and it looks cool obviously I mean this place wouldn't look half as cool if it didn't have sprinklers just always going at non-stop um, so I do have some things built um, for instance I have a single sh machine frame actually I think I have another machine frame somewhere in one of the crafting benches I was trying to make something but then I realized I didn't have any rubber so let's go and see if I left a machine frame downstairs in the crafting bench. So what I want to do is build the extractor. That's the first order of business. Yeah, I have everything in here except for the plastic sheets. So I'm actually going to leave these in here. And this will make um, the harvester block, this thing right here. Also, we need to, actually while we're down here, I guess, would be the best place to start. Um, if we go ahead and get extractor look at this uh, it's going to be this one unfortunately um, industrial craft is my least favorite mod but we will have to make it apparently um, we'll have to do it so I don't want to do that one that's for sure come on there we go okay so iron plate hammer with an iron bar. So how do you make a fuck me? All right, so we're already into. Oh, shit, I forgot that uh, the power is in a state of flux. Let's go see what the power is doing. What I did was, I did finish building the reactor, which this will give us perfect opportunity for you guys to see it while it's functioning. Uh, last time, I believe the episode ended with me putting in the resonant ender uh, liquid that cools the core of our big reactor which is now finished it's all set up and ready to go now it has, it has been on but obviously it's not um, filling up because I turned it off because I didn't need all that power and I didn't want it to, oh look at this something's happened so that this uh, side has changed colors even though it's not supposed to um, what side is that orange I need to turn that one to black because it doesn't need anything hooked up to it and I think which one's blue? Is this thing? Yeah, it's filled up. So this front bit needs to be orange. That's not it. That's not it. Damn it. Uh, that's it. Okay. So that should be good to go now. Um, let's see. We'll see. Uh, I do think I want to turn this back on while it's powered. See, as you can see, it's trickling out, and that what the reason is is this thing is acting like a wire instead of a storage unit so it's just taking power directly from this stuff and and it's just using this as a as a uh, as an extra wire instead of recognizing that it's a storage cell which is not a big deal but it's not the best um, it's sort of making this thing pointless if it's not going to use the power from the red the energy cell which I did update to a hardened energy cell uh, which is the second tier of energy cell, which gives us like four times as much a storage as our other one. Um, so what it's going to be doing is we've got it powering up. We've got all the power coming from these engines and all the power from our reactor. It's just all coming straight through here and into this. So our computer should be on at the very least. Uh, this is on, isn't it? Oh, it's not. Okay, so I'm going to turn this on and let this, this reservoir fill up and also produce hopefully some cyanide. Uh, because you use the cyanide, we discussed this, we use the cyanide to make other more advanced things for big reactors. Um, it's the uh, byproduct of running a reactor, a basic reactor. Um, so, what I am going to need to do next is make sure the computer is is functioning correctly. Basically. So, um, let's see... Yes, okay, it's back on. Um, I have some various things in here, including, but not limited to, some redstone stuff. Um, so what I was going to do was build a hammer, apparently. I'm going to have to build a damn hammer. Uh, so I'm going to take 
all this stuff out and I'm gonna put some of it into a computer to not make up as much take up as much space uh, put this in there it's gonna put a bunch of stuff in there man it's gonna put a bunch of stuff in there all right good okay we got some room in our inventory now put that in there why not all right so I need to just continue to clear that I'm gonna try to there we go okay it's all sorted and ready to go so now we just need the sticks like this and I need one two five 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 iron so that's shift click five oh, that's six that is six there we go five iron boom forge hammer now this is obviously not the best way you can build these machines that do this for you but I don't really feel like going into industrial craft very much this extractor is like the the, the only thing I really want and I'm only doing it because I want to do something with another mod so extractor I need bait oh wow we're gonna need a bunch we're gonna need a bunch of this okay so I'm just gonna get 32 and I'm gonna see how much this hammer will do before it runs out oh we'll do all of it okay so it does about a little over a stack of iron before it'll run out perfect okay um, now I just need to build this stuff up so I need some wood for four tree taps I need the basic machine casing I think I'm gonna do the wood thing first even though I don't know if I have enough actually so it's that it's that the thing um, is it like this yeah okay there's two three nope not even close I mean it's pretty close I guess can't say it's not even close three there's three of the possible I'm gonna can I, no I can't okay I'm gonna go cut some trees down damn so this has become an issue the, the wood shortage has become an issue guys I mean in real life I have plenty of wood but in this game I have no wood zero wood I'm gonna make sure I don't have any wood before I go out there and cut some wood no, doesn't look like I have any wood. Hmm, no wood, no wood to be found, guys. There's only like one wood here, and it's like the kind you can't even use. Can I put these together and make a wood block? No, can't. What a waste. What a waste. Okay, so what we're going to do is I'm just going to punch a tree down for now. Uh short-term solution but eventually I do want to just have like a tree farm that just gives me oak planks out the asshole like I'm actually going to have oak planks coming out of my butt not even of metaphor or you know not being ironic or satiric I'm actually going to have oak coming out of my ass Whew, looking forward to that anyway um, so once we get this done we'll have the extractor okay the extractor will then get us rubber straight from the wood of the rubber tree. Then we'll be able to turn the rubber into plastic and the plastic into plastic sheets, which we need for pretty much every single uh, machine block that the Mine Factory Reloaded mod uses. So that's where we're heading. That's the end goal is plastic sheets. Not only that, but if we have any extra can totally wrap somebody's dead body up in it and um, commit uh, the perfect crime. Ooh, perfect crime. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. All right, uh, let's get some wood. We're almost done with this massive. I I, uh, I uh, underestimated the the massiveness of that tree there. I underestimated it completely. Look at this horrible spot. What am I gonna put here? You guys need to recommend some sort of building or facility I need to build right here. Maybe I will build my house there. After all, I was going to build the hill, I guess. I was going to extend that hill so it went all the way over here, but I don't know. I don't know. Sky's the limit, but also my laziness is the limit as well. Um, so I've got oak wood now. I'm going to turn them all... Oh, wow, look at this. i got so much wood. I have a full stack of it. i got a full stack of wood. 64 wood planks. Come on, door, you bitch. All right, um, we're going to stairs. We're going to stairs. By that, I mean we're going downstairs. I guess, do you really, would you call it downstairs if it didn't have stairs that led down? Would you call it, like, down elevator? I don't know. I don't think so. It doesn't seem right that you would call it downstairs if you have no stairs. Down ladder, maybe. I don't know. Um, so, what was I doing? Oh, yeah, I was making another fucking 
thing. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to put this on the floor. I'm just going to throw it onto the floor. And then I'm going to see if I can make a machine block. Throw those on the floor now. And what else? We need this thing. So, shit. Are you serious? Oh, no. I just realized something. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Wait, 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 I got an idea. What was that other one? Is it easier? Yeah, it doesn't even require any rubber. Perfect. That makes more sense. More sense. Okay, let's see if we can do the hammer thing. Let's see if we can do the hammer thing here. The MC hammer thing. Um, first of all, I'm going to put this wood up in our storage. Okay, and... Let me think here. I'm going to put the buckets up, too. Um, what was I doing? <laughs> I keep forgetting what I'm doing here. All right, so I need copper to see if this hammer will crush it into, into copper plate. So let's see if this thing works. It should work. It's a standard ore, so I imagine this thing is going to function. Yeah, boom. Shakalaka. Okay, uh, <laughs> I don't know why I said it like that. That was a very strange cadence. Um, so I need red... Oh, wow. That This may not be the best way. I didn't realize I needed all this shit for this. But I think I have it. I think I have it. I don't know why I'm talking weird. Come on. Quit switching. Quit switching on me, dude. All right. Um, marble. This is just... Regular stone? Can I use? I think I can use regular stone on this. If that's the case, I have that. I have it, and I also have quartz in there too. I think. Yep. Where did I get this squid? Why is there just a squid in my inventory? Jesus, I'm living a strange life when I'm offline. All right. Um, I'm gonna throw this on the ground for sure. Let's see here. Let me see. Here, I needed this thing, so I need to make four of these. Okay, I'm going to do it. I need a bunch of redstone. And I'm going to go ahead and put books up in, the, in there, okay? And so I put this in the middle. I put the stone along the bottom. And then I do this, or is it redstone things? Ah, it is torches. Okay. It is redstone torches. I'm sorry. Uh, I need to put those away, make as many of these redstone torches. That's not going to be enough. It's not even going to be close to enough. Okay. That's fine, though. Um, redstone torches. Let's just make as many as we can. That should just be one worth, um, and one of these, and voila. We have one redstone repeater. Peter. <laughs> uh. All right, um, I need to put some stuff up, guys. I'm sorry. This is always, this is a constant battle. So I'm just going to put that cobblestone. I'll put these up to, why not? All right, that looks fine. Put some of that, okay. All right, so now I need more wood out of here. I'm gonna get like eight, eight wood. Not sure that's enough. Not maybe it's too much. Doesn't matter. I'm gonna do it like so. All of them are gonna be crystal torches. All uh, right, now we just need three worth. That's not what I wanted. Boom. All right, so. We've got that. I need four, though, so I'm just going to go ahead and subtract that out. And then I'll put... I could have just left it, huh? I don't know why I just put that back. I have no idea. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I actually only need three of these. Because I already have one. Okay, perfect. All right, let's go ahead and do that. I'm going to put this back now. I hope I have the things that I need. That's not right. Uh, it's almost right, though. And I think it's like, is it just regular redstone? Yeah, it's just regular redstone. This should work. If it doesn't work, I'm actually going to... Uh, I guess I'm going to have to do what I was about to say, which was eat some ice cream and celebrate my... Um, ah, it's bronze! I'm such a dumb fat...
bastard. It's all right. It's not a big deal, I guess. All right. Uh, what do I do? Okay, I'm gonna put this in there now. Son of a bitch. All right, that's done. <laughs> that's done at least. Okay, so now I just need to put this in, then put these in. Extractor, everyone, it's coming at you. Oh, I hate this mod. I fucking hate Industrial Craft. I hate it so much. Like, there's nothing I hate in... There's no mod that I hate more than Industrial Craft. Jeez. Okay, so with that said, it doesn't matter. I guess I'm going to have to hook this bad boy up to our power system and hope that it works with the, uh, the mod. Oh, shit. Where is the wire at? How far does the wire run? I don't think I put enough wire. I don't know why I'm talking like Will Shatner. Where is our uh, maintenance axis? Where is that bad boy? Nope. Nope. Did I not put a maintenance axis in this one? Surely I did. I'm fairly confident that I put a maintenance axis in this bastard. Maybe I didn't, though. It's supposed to be a hatch. Um, a, um, what are they called? Who cares? Who cares what they're called? I just need to go downstairs and see what's happening. Aha. Uh -huh. Why? Okay, so I've run it. Oh, I remember now. Okay. I've run it. I need to put the other thing back first. I've run it so that it's got a... It extends from the very center, which is where the Tesseract is, in every direction all the way to here, but it doesn't run. Okay, so I'm just going to start here then, so I don't have to run any more wires. Oh, I do have to run one more, though, which is fine, because I have those that I put in the computer. Um, now, hopefully, the Industrial Craft 2 works with um, thermal expansion. I honestly would not put it past Industrial Craft 2 to not work with anything, though, so. Okay, so stored, no power stored, power, max power. I'm just going to put some stuff in and see what happens. All right, perfect. So we know for a fact that Industrial Craft is like one of the only mods that will refuses to actually update itself to work with other mods. Awesome. Thank you, Industrial Craft Creator. I have another reason to find you and kill you in your sleep. Booyah! Alright, um, so the next thing I guess I need to do is make a generator. Um, apparently I'm back in the, back like six or seven years ago whenever TechIt started becoming popular. Um, I, we've traveled back in time, so now I have to actually do this shit over again. Um, it was this thing. Uh, which is just a coal generator, unfortunately. Really? You can do that, huh? I don't think that's right. An RE battery just in a crafting bench gives me a generator. I don't think this is going to work, but I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it. Um, actually, I'm going to see what this costs. Oh, we need a furnace, huh? Let's see. Let's see. Um, generator, I mean, if this is real and I just have to make this battery, then that'd be awesome, so. Okay, so let's crush some tin up into plates, apparently. And we need four plates, and then we just need, oh, really, how, how am I supposed to do this? I guess I'm just going to cook this resin up into rubber and make some wires with it. Alright, that's fine. I'm going to cook them anyway. What else am I going to do with this resin? Where the hell did the resin go? Did I put it in the... I'm the worst. I'm the worst. Where'd the resin go? I had resin. Now it's not. <laughs> I had resin and now it's not. Just said that. Oh, really? I did have resin. You guys saw the resin. Did I put it in somewhere to cook? I don't think I did. I know I didn't. Wait, did I put it in this... 
wait a minute, the extractor. Did I put it in the extractor like an idiot? Yes, why would I do that? It still doesn't work, but still, I'm stupid. I'm sorry. Uh, you guys are probably like, what the fuck is he doing? <laughs> oh, God. Okay, so we're going to cook the resin up in our furnace. That works perfectly because it's not industrial craft. And we're going to find a way to power this. Now, I'm going to go ahead and check and see what's going on down here. Maybe if I just, like, no. Okay. All right. Just checking to make sure. Um, that sucks, sir. Industrial craft 2. Worst ever. That's their theme song. Industrial Craft 2, the worst ever. Not the best theme song, but it is accurate. Okay, um, we have rubber now. And I just need to put it next to some tin cable, I guess. So let's find some tin. Tin, 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 tin. Ah, there's some tin right there. Perfect. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and flatten some of this stuff. All right, let's make sure, okay? Let's make sure. Ah, okay, so we flatten it once. I'm going to flatten four of these bad boys, and then we flatten it again. Oh, look at that. Perfect. This hammer actually makes the mod less annoying. I, I will say that. Normally, you have to have, like, a fucking... whatever it's called that you would need to make these plates with. Um, now I have the hammer, which make, gives us a... a uh, immediately the opportunity to flatten out metal into plates and stuff. Okay, so we have these things. Now we just need this thing, which is... Oh, what the hell? Metal former. We need a cutter, which is... Oh my god. It's not bad, I guess. Alright, so I need more iron. Oh, I have iron. I have iron. Oh, I don't have ingots, though. So, two ingots... And then the plates make that. Now we just need to put tin, I guess. No? No, apparently not. Apparently not. Apparently that's not how you do it. Ah, okay, 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 okay. Makes sense. Doesn't really make sense, but it, I guess I'll, I'll go with it. All right, so I've got a plate. Put the plate in with these cutters, and boom. Gives me an achievement. What a bastard. Alright, so it's like it's taunting me for having to do this. Industrial craft, everyone. More like industrial crap, am I right? What do you think the number two stands for? Uh, I'm talking about poop. That's what I'm talking about. Alright, and we have wires now. I have wires. I have these things. I think it's redstone? Boom. I knew it wasn't going to work. I fucking knew it wasn't going to work. It just says, hey, if you put me in here with a blank thing, it'll give me a generator, but I knew. I knew in my heart it wasn't going to be that easy. Mostly because for whatever reason, like half the time, if they have like two recipes on top of each other, the second one never works. Son of a bitch. Where did I even get this concrete from in my inventory? It's like things are just manifesting inside my inventory now at this point. Son of a bitch. Alright, I'm going to put the tin away. Actually, I may not. I think I need... I need the battery regardless because we're going to have to use it. But um, I have the iron plates. I need the furnace. Okay, that's, that's it's easy enough, though. It's not a big deal. So I'm going to go ahead and get eight of these cobblestones. And make us a furnace to use on this. And then we need, like, iron, like this. Oh, yeah. And then we put this here, we put this here, and what do we need in the middle? Iron plates. Boom. Well, that wasn't so bad. It wasn't good. wasn't so bad, though. And if I'm lucky, these tin wires that I have extra will also be able to power this thing. They hook up. We'll see if they work. So now I just need to pop some coal into that thing. Because we're living in the fucking coal age. I don't know. I'm going to take... You know what? I'm going to take a full stack. Because um, 
it's like the only thing we need this for because this is the only mod that requires me to live in the coal age, the aforementioned coal age. All right, so it's working. It is working. Son of a bitch. What an extraordinary thing that we just had to go through. I would say a journey, but it's more like um, walking across hot coals, um, but instead of on your feet, you have to use your testicles to walk, which doesn't work because if you have testicles, you know for a fact that you cannot walk on them. You've tried. I know I've tried to walk on my testicles, use them as my feet. doesn't work. You're going to injure yourself, probably some sort of testicle injury, testicle related, uh, in, uh, some sort of fracture. Maybe you're going to fracture your testicles, I don't know. Even if you are, um, you have the female genitals down there, you could just try that too, but I'm confident, even though I don't have uh, that set up, I'm confident it wouldn't work. Um, you would have some sort of rug burn, I guess, I don't know. Um, maybe even uh, like a clitoral fracture I don't I don't know maybe who knows okay so I've got rubber let's get away from that conversation please I've gotten myself into that uh, that place of no return there all right so we have everything going at this point honestly I've sort of forgotten what the hell I'm even doing I, I guess it's just the I we're just doing this to make plastic at this point which is awful 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 just awful um, so we all we have to do is recook the rubber, I think, to make it into plastic, and then we make the plastic, the raw plastic, into r the sheets. So all this stuff is going upstairs. So I can just leave it and let it go, and then go up, go d up to the computer, and get it. I don't know how much of this I'm going to need. I'm only building two of the machines to start out with. Uh, there's a bunch of machines, but not all of them are going to be farming. It's not a farming mod. It's just a mod that sort of covers a whole bunch of stuff and automated, so automates a bunch of Minecraft things, uh, including farming. And it's so much easier. Uh, I'll say that as we've gone through, like, we've jumped through at so many hoops just to get here, but it's a lot easier, even with that said, than, like, forestry.